what's up youtube it's your girl honey be back to deliver another daily buzz for you guys welcome to my new subscribers welcome back to my return subscribers my day ones even if you just so happen to stumble across this video and you see something that you like or hear join our colony by hitting the subscribe button down below hit the notification bell so that you can be notified when i do premiere to the channel let's go ahead and tap into the reading you guys let's see what the collective has going on what y'all got going on see what kind of energy is buzzing around y'all what you can expect for the up and coming weekend let's go ahead and do um around the next 48 hours right that's going to be the intent for this reading so around the next 48 hours we'll see what you can expect or what's going on in your energy before we start y'all let me go ahead and put a gratitude card this morning i channeled um I kept hearing grat gratitude is the attitude, 55 on the timer. So 55 is about change. So be grateful for the change, right? Um, today my love shines out from my heart and touches everyone I meet. Sending that positive affirmation towards my collective. So give us a gratitude message, Spirit. Give us a message of gratitude to start our weekend off. I'm only going to take one of those. Okay, I like this one. It says, fix your thoughts on what is true and honorable and right and pure and lovely and admirable. Think about things that are excellent and worthy of praise. So, so this is like, just focus on the positive. You know, it's, uh, uh, it, again, it's about retraining of the mind. You know, like... We have a whole life to live. We're always going to be going through something. So instead of saying how tired you are and, and I'm not saying, you know, not to get tired because we all do. But instead of speaking that into your life, you know, instead of saying you're tired, how tired you are of going through something, like put a positive spin on it. Like you're going to get, the, I'm going to get through this just like I got through the last thing or the thing before that. Like we're always going to be going through something. It's about perception, your, your the way you perceive things. Two, two, two on a timer, right? If you perceive it as a negative, it's going to bring in more negative negativity. So just shift the perspective a little bit. Be grateful for where you are. Be grateful for the silence. Be grateful for the standstill. There is even, there's purpose in the stagnation. There's purpose in the stagnation, Right? All right, let's jump in. Where do I want to go first? Tarot. Let me let me hop on these tarot first. What's going on? What is my collective expect? What is the energy around my collective um, for today? Over the for today to the weekend. Okay, some of you may be going out partying. Some of you may be going out partying, right? And but you know what? I was also going to say some of you may be being selfish with yourself because this person is like, there's nine cups. There's one them. You're not sharing with nobody. Like this is you have, it's almost like you're hidden, right? Like you're keeping, and you know what I hear? Like you're keeping your, ble you're keeping your good news to yourself. You're keeping it under wraps. I don't never get this off of this card. And walking away from some things, right? And it's like, hmm. Huh. We gonna see, we gonna see what this is. You know what, I looked at this moon and he's looking down at this guy in a red cloak, but it's kind of like he hanging his head. And normally this is, you know, you walking away from something, which you could have walked away from something, but I feel like this is someone walked, walked that walked away from you. When I looked at this moon, I heard them say, mm, pitiful. Like they talking about this person. <laughs> okay. Okay, okay, okay. So someone is feeling like, hmm, they let their good thing get away. Thank you for the confirmation spirit. They're ten of cups to the two of cups. Someone walked away from their end all be all, literally. You had the eight, the eight to the nine to the ten with the two of cups. Someone walked away from a soulmate. You could have been someone's soulmate. They you know, thank you for the confirmation spirit. Someone had their guard up. This person was in and out non-committal, right? This person didn't want to take a leap of faith with you. So what is this person's energy? Look, they feeling like you was a missed opportunity because they stood still. Not a pinnacles don't move, you guys. He's a serious thinker. But 
he can also be an overthinker, right? Hmm. Isn't this always the story? Oh, look, the magician. I didn't even see that back there. It's almost like somebody was... Now, nah, you see, when I seen that, now nah, that changes the story. Because, nah, you know what? I heard this person was tricked. So, it's almost like some this person was tricked. It's almost like they made a promise. You know, like they made a promise. It's almost like they made a promise. Right? Because it's like he going through something. Like he, he battered and bruised over here. But he's still looking over. And if I lay it down, he's still looking over at this nine of cups. Like... Right? This could be him. This person walked away from the Nada Cups to go get bat battered. And I'm not saying physically, you know, but like this person, wherever they went, they ate this person up. I'm hearing they didn't stand a chance. Jeez. And it's like, if this was instant karma. Damn, spirit. Oh, this person walked away from that whole, they hold 10 of Cups. This person fumbled a bag. Yeah, I let go of my good thing is what I'm hearing. They walked clean away from their nine of cups. They wish they wish is fulfilled. And for a lot of you, they left, they left for tangible things. Because, yeah, nine of cups is about wishes fulfilled, but it, it's, it's not the star, right? The star is a major. Like, you know, that's promise. Like, this is temporary. Because anybody can come and knock these cups off the top of this table. Right? Anybody can come and knock them off. Because, you know what? He got nine cups. Nine cups. When you get to the ten of cups, you want... Ooh. You want somebody to share it with. And whoever they went to share it with, trick this person. The devil with the, the king of cups. Love spell. Energy. Somebody put... Hmm. Hmm. Wow. I say instant karma, like... Like, it's almost like they lured this person away. The stable home, the stable foundation, you know, this person was promised a lot of things. Like, oh, you know, they, they were made a lot of plans with this person, whoever they went towards, you know. They did. But, you know, it's so crazy because this person knew that that, that wasn't their, their wishes fulfilled. Like, there was they would, the 3D possessions, yeah. But on a soul level, it was you. You were the nine of cups. But they ran away for... They rent towards someone else for the devil. This is like obsessions. Material things. It's nothing, there's nothing wrong with having materialistic things, you guys. But at the end of the day, you can't take none of that with you. Like, at least if you go, you'll be able to say you had peace and pure love, right? I say pure love. Like, so the, what you and this person share is pure. You had the eight, the nine, eight to the nine to the ten of cups. You had the king of cups here. You had the two of cups. The only... Toxic energy is what this person walked away to go towards. A toxic love situation where they could have been working magic on this person. Right? Hmm. Look, the star. Ten of Pentacles. Right? Like, they made, they made promises with this person. They went and built a village. They went and they had things. Those tangible things. Damn. Oh, wow. Hmm. Hmm. Look, they bored. Listen, they probably planted having things, but it's like this is all they feel like they, they got out of the situation. It's like I'm I, I have all this for nothing, like you know? Like because even it don't matter what they have, this person is not satisfied. Cause remember, it's it wishes fulfilled, but it's 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 minor. It's tangible. M minors are tangible, worldly, more worldly things. So when you get to the majors, that's more from the divine, was sent. Hmm. I keep hearing pitiful. Because it's almost like this person walked away and they knew what they were walking away from. Huh. Sabotage, self-sabotage, look. They conflicted. They conflicted right now. This person don't know what to do with themselves. They feel like a fool for not taking this leap of faith. This person feel like a fool. They, 
the ten on the timer, the dead. They feel like a fool for dead in this situation. They going through a transformation because of it. Because of it, dark night of the soul is what I'm hearing. But they also want to transform this death energy. If you look in the far back, right here, right about here, y'all, the sun is rising. You see. For every ending, there's a new beginning. This person want to revive this connection. Look, regret, pitiful. Thank you, spirit. Thank you, spirit. This person regret breaking your heart. Because now they ass heartbroken. Because you done moved on. They, and you know what? This person never thought. They never, and, and when they made this decision, they never thought that the day would come when they would miss you the way they do. All this person do is watch it. And that's just the T. Self-sabotage. Sneaking. This person may ride by your house too. If they know where you live. If if that's not the case. You don't live near this person. There's distance between you and this person. This could be like. You know what I also. Like the sword is about. You know gathering information. That's like Google. That's watching your social media. Um, the, the cherry. That's about movement. Like to me this is the internet. You know what I'm saying. Watching you in secret. But you know what. What they. Hmm. <laughs> But they feel trapped. They trapped by their circumstances. Trapped by their circumstances. Thank you for the confirmation, spirit. Thank you for the confirmation, spirit. Sorry about that, y'all. Sorry about that. Hmm. 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 Three of Pentacles with the dead. If there's any interference, they want to they want to put a hold to the interference. They want to stop the interference. There's interference somewhere. You have six of pentacles, six of pentacles with the three of pentacles, with the eight of pentacles. This person is either working on the master plan or this person is working. Um, I hear working on a master plan, but this person went and they put in effort with another party. Like there's definitely a third party. This person was breadcrumbing you. They was breadcrumbing you, right? Hmm. Hmm. Y'all give into two situations. Look, this is what I'm saying. Somebody could have been breadcrumbing them. Y'all, I said like so with that magician, that magician popped up behind that out of that card, behind that card. Excuse me, I'm stuttering. I'm trying to get it out so fast. They said like why would a magician need a hide? You know what I'm saying? If it's not spell work, if it's not, you know, black magic, like why would that be hidden behind a king of cups? That's like somebody pulling the string. Like these two people here on the string by the devil. Like, I hear having by the balls. Like, you know, for some of you, there could be kids involved in the situation. Hmm. Oh, wow. And it's a third party. It's a third party. You know what else I see too? This third party, because this is, you know, the kids, this could be the connection, this could be the kids, or this could be the connection and them breadcrumbing you, right, just given two situations. There don't have to be kids involved. There could be. But it's like this person, that talked about that spell work, this person, they working with a third party. So it's them, the third, it's him, them, the, their practitioner, the person they're going to see to get the work done, and the tools. They paying somebody for this. This is Eight of Pentacles. This is about work, working on something. They paying a third, they getting with somebody to do this. This is real sad. It's like, almost like this person was tricked. Like, look, he poking out again, hiding in the back, still hiding in the back. This is crazy. To keep this person conflicted. 14, 14 on the timer. When I picked it up, y'all, it was in a reverse. So Ace of Swords, somebody, some kind of, I'm hearing this zero song, it's time to let the truth be told. There ain't no brighter days. Look, some communication gonna come in. Some communication gonna come in. It's gonna be found out. It's the Ace of Swords. Some truth is gonna be revealed. Look, this Eight, eight of Wands. Two of, two of swords in reverse. Look, the chariot. This is about moving forward. This is about moving forward. This, yo. They they trying to keep up someone from moving forward. Keep them rested. 
This is about moving forward. This is about moving forward. Major and minor. minor. Something that was divinely guided. And this person is just, they just laying there. It's like, almost like this is reminding me of, was the sleeping spell? Like, they got this person on a sleeping spell. Like, you know, to keep them like, look. I talked about that towel. Talked about that towel. And the killing part is, the moving away. This person could move away. This is what they're supposed to be doing. They're supposed to be moving forward. But somebody's manipulating, working with the, with the energies to keep this person stuck, right? This King of Pentacles energy. This could be someone that's married, long-term investments. Like, they, this is who the person that they made promises with, that they build legacies with, that they're having things with. You know what I'm saying? Like, this is that person. The person they, they, is like they're in a trance. Look. This King of Pentacles is almost look like he in a trance. I hope y'all can see that. It was 1555 on the time when I said that. I'm getting to a point, y'all. All he got to do is look this way. He, this is his exit. He he wants the divine. He waited for the divine, right? To come in and take him out of this mess. And all he got to do is look the other way. They got him in a... This, this person is being kept. This person is being kept. They don't want to stay. They show me a little bird in a cage. That's what I'm seeing. A caged love. Like somebody carrying this person in a little cage. That's the image I'm getting. Somebody carrying this this person in in a cage. And this person got big energy. I heard I just hear that. Big, big energy. Look, again, look, look what's in the back. The magician. <laughs> this is crazy, y'all. Wow, look. They stress in the press. Like, this person can't understand why. Like, you know, I hear this like I have no reason to stay. Like, this person feels like there's no reason to stay where they are. Whether this is in a relationship, which I think it is. You know, like, this is crazy. Love spells. Thank you for the confirmation spirit and whatnot. Like, this is out of control. Whoever this person is dealing with, they out of control. Like, this person is being kept. They do not want to stay here. This third part, this connection, whoever that what they're giving into is toxic as hell. This is a binding. Like this, I like I want to keep you bound to me. Like this is this is not healthy. Like they're showing me a little a big bowl of candy, right? Like that's not healthy for you versus a big bowl of fruit. That, that's the comparison that I'm getting. It's hard. Look. Look. Not a nine of swords to the ten of wands. This is somebody about to crumble. This person is getting heavy on them. It's weighing on them. You know when you hear somebody say it's weighing on me or it's weighing on you could you, you could see it. Like when something is weighing on a person, you could see it in their face. Ooh. Y'all check that last reading if y'all haven't saw it. Um, the last reading, the last reading. This person feel like they missed an the opportunity, and they crying about it. Like this person is in regret. They regret. This person regret their decision. It's almost like. So this could have been someone that grew up with it or nothing, or maybe they had things. You know what I'm saying? It don't matter like what the scenario was, but they thought going towards this situation, like. It was about an image. It's, it This situation may have made them look more presentable to society than the connection with you. So they chose to go there. They chose to go there. They chose the 3D. The addictions. The, you know, things that weren't good for their soul. This could be addictions. Right? And... They dangle something in front of this person that they knew they wouldn't be able to resist. And they fell for it. They gave them everything they ever wanted. That's what I'm saying. They made promises with this person. And the promises that they made, they, they was fulfilled. Oh, yeah. They was definitely fulfilled, right? Like, the status, the money, the, you know, like, the nice things, like, the flashy things. Well, yo... Having all that and still being miserable, and that's something that eats that eats is eat this person up on the inside. Like this is something that is that that's with, within. 
Because they can't sell this to nobody, right? Because keep in mind, this is an ideal partnership. This is what you left for. Not only that, how dare they come back. I keep telling y'all, look, pitiful. This person is pitiful at this time. Miserable. Can't make it up. Pitiful. Mm. Just look at them. Like, you know, they dangled in front of this person. Just look at them go. Just look at him walk away from his nine, his nine of cups. You know what I hear? You, he'll be back. You'll be back. And it's not like they feel like they can't come back. They crying. They finding it hard to come back, come toward you even, right? This person do feel trapped, but even in their mind, even in their mind, yo, this person is trapped. That eight of swords came out. Did it come out? This person is trapped in the mind, like. Because they, how they going to come back towards you, right? They didn't want you. They didn't want you. They had a hard time choosing. And in the end, the things that they, that, the things that they thought mattered most, they don't even matter no more. It means nothing if you're not sharing it with who you really want to share it with. You could pretend. You could wear a mask. You could pretend to be happy. That's cool. But... You know, and as the killing part is, again, this person keep thinking about this missed opportunity. Again, they stay embarrassed. This person is embarrassed to come back towards you, to face you for a lot of you. So they just watch you. This person is embarrassed to come towards you with the six of cups energy. They feel like it's just a missed opportunity. That's why they just stand still. And then again, this person is so stubborn, right? Because again, this is the hand of the divine. Giving them the same opportunity and they not even looking at it. Just like they not looking, they not, they wasn't looking at, they not looking at they, they tower. All this person got to do is look to the other side. This is their tower moment again. This is their blessing right here. Being handed to them and they not even looking. This person is stubborn. This somebody could be stuck in their ways. This person not seeing clearly. They somebody, this person is being blinded, y'all. Telling y'all, telling y'all, it's some spell work. Look, reveal. Reveal, broken, unsatisfied, pitiful, confusion. I can't make this up. Shadow side, right? This person is facing the fact that their obsessions, their shadow side, their flaws, what they love, 22, 22 44 on the time as I'm about to spill. The things that they love. That make them look good, right? Right? Flashy. Attention. I hear attention hoarders. Like, you know, like. They shadow side kept them away from their they destiny. They struggled. They struggled. You were their destiny the whole time. And they struggled to get on that path. And they went towards something else. The stress is draining me. We saw that. The ten of wands with the knight of, with the knight of swords. Look, we saw that. This person is. Uh, and secrets. They keeping it to themselves. This person is keeping it to themselves. They, they detach from you. They want to detach from everything. This for a lot of you, this person just want to run away because they sabotage it. Detaching from you, sabotage. This person feel like they sabotage their destiny, right? This person feel like a fool because their habits, their obsessions. They wanted to. They wanted you to chase them. They wanted to be the center of attention, right? They wanted to be the star of the show. Right? They chase they the chase for a lifestyle. Hmm. Look, they hope. This person would hope. They they dream and have hope that you two could come back and look for a equal give and take in this soul contract. But for a lot of you, they don't even feel they feel like they unworthy. Right? And this is why they keep their distance. Cause again, regret. I hope I, I hope this helps y'all. I'll see y'all in the next video. Peace.